Pollinators are animals that help plants with their reproduction. Their role is to transfer the pollen between flowers. The pollen deposited by pollinators fecundates the ovules which will become the fruit that will perpetuate the cycle of life. Humans, like any other living being on the planet, depend on plants and their sub-products. Plants provide us with nourishment and materials like resin, wood or rubber and fibres for our fabrics as well. Plants produce the oxygen that we breathe and absorb carbon dioxide. Retain the soil and moisture. Help regulate temperatures. And especially, they maintain the food chain. It is clear that pollinators are essential to life on Earth. In fact, 80% of the flowering plants need pollinators to maintain their life cycle. Based solely on their importance in the food industry, 35% of the world's agricultural production depends on pollinators. Recently, the fraction of crops requiring biotic pollination has increased alarmingly. Even though many species can be pollinated by the wind or by self-pollination, insect pollination increases the crop's quality and quantity. Wind pollination is unpredictable and less efficient than pollination by an animal vector. The amount of lost pollen alongside not knowing the pollen source make wind pollination impractical for many crops. That's why in many cases a new pollinator species is introduced to enhance natural pollination. Traditionally, farmers have used social pollinator species that can be incorporated to crops easily and in great quantities. Honeybees, one of 20,000 bee species in the world, is the most used species due to their easy implementation. However, in the last few years it has been demonstrated that honeybees are not always that efficient. The more diverse the community of pollinators is, the better the yields would be. For example, when strawberries are pollinated by a diverse group of pollinators, their quality, size, weight and even its colour improve substantially compared to other strawberries pollinated only by honeybees. This happens because honeybees pollinate various flowers from the same plant, thus increasing the endogamy rates and the problems associated with it. Many scientific studies mm. prove that having diverse pollinator communities is crucial to obtain better crops. To ensure an efficient pollination, many farmers are starting to promote the creation or the preservation of pristine vegetation refuges to secure a greater variety of insects in the area. Agriculture has been expanding quickly to support humanity's needs, causing standardization of the landscape, plagues, low productivity and loss of biodiversity. Sustainable and eco-friendly practices would bring the biggest benefit for everyone.